Hi everyone, my name is Clara and I don't have honestly a specific structure to this video and I think that's what makes it real so all I want really is to share my thoughts and my experiences and perhaps help others to feel inspired and for them to take action in their lives and yeah I mean Okay, starting out, I <laughs> I just, I've always thought that sharing the past and uh, remembering your past experience in life is not relevant because the, when you think about it, you don't want to live it, your life in the past you want to live your life not even in the future you want to live in the now and the now is so important it's like also when you think about the future you may think about oh my gosh like how am i going to achieve this or how is this going to happen whether it's with relationships with friendships with career with all any of that sorts you know but when you think about it you really don't have the need to worry about it because it never has happened to you in the beginning. I mean, those are just thoughts that you create in your head and our thoughts are just so important in our lives. What you think about, honestly, is becomes like who you are in a sense because the more negative thoughts you may have about yourself, more thoughts like, oh, I cannot achieve this or how is this possible for me or when is it how is it going to happen but the when and the house are really not your place to really worry about because the only thing you have to be responsible for is choosing choosing to be for example happy or choosing to be myself where i i feel just so incredibly powerful um and the word powerful to me is that you you have the choices in life to make it yours like you have the option to turn things around and for you to be responsible for the choices that you make and live accordingly to your personal beliefs and i for example had really in the past didn't really think highly of myself i just existed you know and for that it gave me a sense of dishonesty with myself and it gave me no sense of purpose i was really just living and I wanted something more and I tried to look at other external circumstances in my life what if I had gotten this material thing what if I had gotten this specific person to be with me in my life once I had this realization that everything comes from within yourself it all comes down to you it all made sense for me and as soon as I believed in myself, the the one thing that I really have in my life until the end of my life is just yourself. And for you to love and to accept and to forgive yourself is the most honorable thing that you can do in life. And with that, comes a really strong belief that all things are possible for you and to be living here in this very moment in time is your birthright and you deserve the most happiness and the most fulfilling life ever and it really doesn't matter where you stand in life currently but i just think that what really matters is is for you to is for you to uh, just.
be more loving to yourself, be more careful with yourself. And whatever certain situations you may have gone through, that's all in the past and it has already been done. And what you want in the future too, say, I mean, I think everybody wants stability, whether that's with career, with finances, with relationships, with, with friendships. It all comes down to stability in a way. And I think for me, being stable within myself has made everything in my life stable. You really become what you think about. Your mind is just so powerful. And and it, when you when you when you believe in yourself, the beliefs you have about yourself is truly almost like a magical wand. <laughs> you can choose to create what you want in life. When you think about it, the desk, the chairs, the, the bed, the, the artworks, everything that you see in front of you right now was all created through the power of mind from someone and it has become a reality that you can see, touch, hear, taste, whatever in the 3D world. So that's what I'm saying to you is it's unbelievably amazing how the power of your mind exists. And when you take action and once you have this thought, which turns into a belief, if you consistently, you know, think about it. And when you believe and you become that thing and as you become that thing, you harvest all of these wonderful things in life. And if something, I think for me, this is my belief and I want to share with you guys is that when I believe in something, or let's say I, I, uh, I truly believe that something is not right for me. Maybe it's called intuition, but for me, it's just like this knowing. And when something is right for me, I just have this like knowing, this, this great feeling of knowing. And I think of that as an inspired action and it can really direct your your path to life but in the end like whatever you choose to want in life it comes into that form like whatever redirection <laughs> it takes it all comes down it all works out in the end and what you think is truly not meant for you right now who knows you may have to go through some redirects and eventually it's there for you. I truly believe that it's more about the contents of your life rather than the exact time frame of doing this in your 20s, doing this in your 30s and doing this and so on. Not everyone's life is the exact same path, you know? Otherwise, it wouldn't be so fun to live life, I think.